<laughs> hey, what's good, good homie? What's good, follow me on Sunday. All right, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Basic Fan Shot, with another video. You guys are probably asking yourselves, like, what is the whole point of this video, or like, what is this video? But honestly, after watching the first vlog of 2017, the whole Kim Kardashian thing, I don't know, I kind of got bored of like doing vlogs. I mean, like, vlogs are fun and all that, but like, I don't know, like, I got bored of the whole like regular vlog type videos, so now I'm gonna try something different out. But I don't know what to call these, honestly. They're like sort of similar to vlogs, or like sort of, I don't know, to be honest. I just wanna like mess around and see what I like and see what I don't like. I have something new that I'm gonna do, like, right now. A while back, I tweeted like, I was planning to do a Q&A video, basically, but like, I kind of lagged on it and like I just want to like incorporate it to this video just to make it more entertaining just to, you know try something different but I have some questions that some friends asked me just like some nice questions and all that I'm gonna start off with my boy Dylan he asked me a couple questions how many pairs of shoes do you have honestly like Vans 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 Converse Converse five basically I have five main pairs of shoes but I only wear like uh, three of them I think yeah what's your favorite pizza I don't really get anything that's like pre-made I always like get my own topping so I get bacon and green pepper that's really good like I don't feel as unhealthy as I usually would eating some pizza how big is my dinner plate? It's pretty damn big. Do you like swimming? Yeah, I like swimming. I got another question from my boy Cordell. How do you get females? If I knew, I would tell you. I don't, so. Here's a question from my little cousin Alexa. She said, what inspired you to start making YouTube videos? Honestly, you guys know who JDM is. He's always in my videos most of the time, like 90% of the time he's in my videos. He used to make YouTube videos about like pickups, like shoes and all that. And like, it kind of like intrigued me. And I thought it would be fun to try it out. So 2015, I started making YouTube. I started off doing vlogs basically off my iPhone. And then I don't know, like I kind of got bored with it. Or like I just got like unmotivated and I stopped. And then I started again and that stopped. And here I am again in 2017 making more videos. I actually planned just to like keep on doing this, just to, like keep myself busy and just having fun filmmaking. So that's what inspired me to make YouTube videos, my brother. I have a question for you. This is for my friend Milani. Why is Milani so great? Uh, because she's Milani. I don't know. Canada Nikon. This, this is for my boy Ash. My boy Ash. Me, me and him always go back and forth with this. Canada Nikon. None. Bro, I'm a Sony shooter, but I, I recorded like a couple videos with a Canon 70D. I don't have anything against Canon or Nikon, but you know, just I'm Sony. What beach would you consider to be your favorite? Huntington, no doubt. More questions from Ash. Why do mirrorless cameras suck? Why can't Sony compete with Canon? They don't suck. I mean, it just really just, it depends on what you want to do. I mean, for me, a mirrorless is, it makes more sense because it's more compact. I could bring it around everywhere easier than carrying like a DSLR, like all bulked up and stuff. So this is perfect for me. I am rocking the Sony A6000 with a battery grip just for extended battery life for one and for two, my hands are freaking huge compared to this camera. So like it gives me more of a grip, like a lot better. So I like it. Why can't Sony compete with Canon? I mean, Sony's actually taking a really big leap just like now. Sony's taking a really big like lead between Canon and all that. I'm not saying that because that's what I think. I, that's what, just what I've been hearing. So what I've been hearing is Sony's technology is pretty damn nice. More questions. This is my boy Kyrie over from Bespoke Santa. Rate one to 10. I'm guessing you're talking about yourself, bro. I'll rate you a goddamn 20 because you would be your hot. Justin Cortez or C Cortezka. I don't know how to say your name, bro. I don't know if that is your last name or what, but Justin, um, he goes to Corona. What made you want to start filming? After watching a bunch of YouTubers and all that it just got me like what would happen if I made videos and then again my brother used to make videos so he would always help me out like especially when I told him I wanted to start making videos he was really supportive everyone was pretty supportive my brother my sister and all them they they were really supportive so but, uh, yeah Isaac Sierra how much ass you eat I mean considering I only eat ass like Friday to Saturday from like 12 a.m. to like 5 a.m. a lot, pretty, yeah, like a good like handful, you know, pretty good. Those are all the questions that I got. If you ever have any questions that you guys want to ask me, whether it's about my camera, whether it's about like how I edit my editing process, how I edit pictures and all that, feel free to ask me. Um, it just gives me another reason to keep on making videos and I love it. I think today, um, for the rest of the day, because we already went to school and all that, I'm going to get a haircut because my hair is a freaking mess and I'm not going to show you because it's, it's horrible. Yeah, let's go. All right, so we're finally here at the hair spot. My sister's getting her hair done. I'm just waiting to go in. It's about like 8.20 right now, 8.20ish. It's close for it. Okay, we got to go now. I like it. 
pretty dope. I mean, I'm pretty tired. Like, I'm really tired right now. I got some McDonald's. I ate that. I'm just gonna end this video, to be honest. So, yeah, catch you on the next one. I just took a trip, now I'm in Abu Dhabi. I just hit a lick, I told the plug I'm sorry. Always in new places, counting up your faces.